Hey there, it's Walt. So, what does it mean when something you try to do doesn't work? Let's say you're trying some new marketing strategies and they fall flat. Or you're going to experiment with some video and you don't get any great feedback. Or you're going to launch a webinar to teach some information to your clients and prospective clients and nobody signs up. Or you want to create a landing page and a lead magnet to bring new people into your world and, and nobody downloads. What does that mean? Well, here's what it doesn't mean. It doesn't mean that you suck or it sucks or it all sucks or you're a failure or it's a failure or it's all for not. It doesn't mean that. All it means is that it didn't work. Now, this can be a challenge for many of us who have come up through traditional educational systems where there are grades and there are right answers and wrong answers. And it can even be more challenging for those of us who have gone through professional training and have licenses to practice stuff where if we get stuff wrong, it actually means that we could lose our licenses or get sued. That's bad. But in much of business, when something doesn't work, it means only one thing. It didn't work. That's all. It's just a data point. It didn't work. And in business, what this invites us to do is to experiment, to be imaginative, to be quizzical, to begin to test what was working or not working to actually begin to, dare I say, be a bit playful with your business. Because business ought to be fun, it ought to be iterative, it ought to be creative. We, we tend to take it pretty seriously way too much of the time. But these data points are opportunities, they're invitations to go out and test. And the testing is very, very interesting. You know, on a, on a webinar page, for example, a a green button to save your seat will perform at a higher level, generally speaking, than a red button, except in certain circumstances. But you know, the thinking is that green means go and red means stop. And so you experiment. You experiment with different ways to present your marketing, different ways to approach your video. You, you stay in action. What happens all too often, and we see it with folks who are just beginning in business, especially as they come up against a, a wall, they, they can't break through, it's, it's not working, and they create these self-deprecating stories of how horrible they are, how the idea was bad, how... And a lot of times I respond by saying, thank God you didn't have this head trash when you were learning to walk because you'd really be in bad shape now. And the truth is that, you know, when we were growing up, we'd try stuff and we'd fall down and we'd go back and experiment and try it some more. And that's how we learned. That's how we learned to walk. That's how we learned to ride a bike. That's how we learned to do so much in our lives. And yet we come into our, our, our adult lives and we create all of these, these dramatic stories about, about us and about how we're not working or we're bad or it's all bad. And what this does, this has a horrible impact because what it does is it prevents us from doing that very work that we're called to do. You have gifts and talents that only you can share with the world. There are people in the world who need you, who need your voice, who are waiting for you. And, not, and they can't wait for your stories about how bad, bad your idea is. They, they actually need you. And so it's, it's kind of selfish to get caught up in those stories about why it's not working rather than 
to stay in action, to lean into that discomfort, that, that uncertainty, and to push into testing and experimenting and iterating and being creative so that you can get it right, so that you can get your message out in the world and do that important work that you're called to do. So I invite you to stay away from the stories and to stay creative and iterative so that it's not about whether you failed or whether you're bad. It's just about, wow, it didn't work. Let me see what might work. Stay in that place and amazing things will happen. Make it a great rest of the day, great rest of the week. Bye for now.